Hi everyone, I'm Ania G. Today's video is going to be my top 10 Amazon beauty finds. Everything is going to be linked down below and by the time this video goes up, I will also be linking a Google spreadsheet that has all of my favorite Amazon videos. So anything that you see in this video or that I mentioned before that I got from Amazon, you can click on that link and you can buy it yourself. All of the products mentioned in this video I have been using for quite some time and I absolutely love them and swear by them and they make like my beauty routine so much easier like my daily life so much easier so I just want to share them with you guys I hope you guys enjoy them if you guys want to see more videos of things that I got from Amazon let me know down below in the comments don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you have not already I want you guys to be honest comment down below how many times a week you order from Amazon because if you're like me you get maybe like three to four Amazon packages weekly like you know we're we're all we all do it so just be honest comment down below how many times you get a package from Amazon a week so I'm reading everything off of my iPad right here because I made a list um the first thing that I absolutely love from Amazon is my face steamer um, I just add a little bit of water to it, plug it in, turn it on, and it heats up the water and it steams my face. Um, I just sit there, I'm going to show you guys a little clip, and I just sit it on my face for about 10 to 15 minutes and it opens up your pores. I do this after I've already washed my face so that when I put the products on, like if I want to use a face mask or it's really good for helping hydrate your skin, like if you have dry skin like me, and just opens your pores and it helps all the products seep in and work so much better and it gives you like an at home spa type vibe like it's it's really nice so if you want to treat yourself pamper yourself that's something that i do maybe like once a week when i don't have my lash extensions on but yeah it's really nice and it's easy to use so if you wanted to use it like every couple of days i don't know how often you do your face mask all that stuff yeah that's what that's for it is thebombs.com i've been using satin pillowcases for years like I swear by satin pillowcases that's all that I use I have a pink pillowcase black and white one and I just kind of switch them out um as you guys know like if you have natural hair or if you just don't like wearing bonnets like I mentioned before I don't really wear a bonnet like that but um yeah satin pillowcases are good for your hair because it allows for moisture to stay as in cotton pillowcases it strips your hair of its natural oils and things like that and it's also really good for your skin because it's soft on your skin um if you're acne prone or whatever you're just really into your skin keeping a satin pillowcase will really help your skin stay fresh and nice and clean and pretty looking but yeah I have a couple different ones just because you know you're supposed to change your pillowcase very often so yeah that's why and yeah I like black and I like pink that's my bed decor color as you can see in my room is pink so yeah that's why I have black and pink but yeah if they also have um some full bed sets that are satin on Amazon but I don't really need it I didn't really need any sheets when I got them. Next thing that I have on this list is my ice roller. I mentioned in another video that I use an ice roller for my under eye bags, which I mention all the time. You guys know that I really struggle with under eye bags and people like to put ice under their bags. They like to use jade rollers, um, rose quartz rollers um, under their eyes, which I also use those as well. But in the morning or before I'm gonna go out or before I take pictures of anything I use an ice roller I keep it in the freezer um I keep it in the freezer and so the roller part is just frozen at all times and I roll it across my face I've showed you guys a little demo but I'll show you guys again um and it just helps reduce puffiness in my face so I look like so much more alive and awake like throughout the day and it's really a lifesaver like it's a temporary fix but it definitely helps like say if you're crying you don't want people knowing you're crying use that ice roller and you'll look normal another thing that i have on the list for my under eye bags is this eye treatment mask um i showed this in my skincare routine it has collagen in it um 
originally i was looking for the pixie under eye patches but they were only on ulta and i wanted them super fast and i didn't want to pay ulta shipping so i got them from amazon like you know amazon prime like you get it pretty much two days the next day later um and it's free shipping so i ordered that and it works amazing i use it every under uh, i use it every other night under my eyes as part of my skincare routine it also comes with a little spoon so that you don't contaminate it like with your hands or anything and then you just place it on your face it's so easy to use and I, you can either let it stay all night or you can let it sit for maybe 30 minutes however long until it just dries out um yeah and it really makes a difference like when you use it consistently it genuinely makes a difference in the appearance of your under eye bags because it's filled with collagen so it fills fine lines and reduces like tired looking tiredness signs of aging collagen is amazing it's it's truly a gift from above so yeah love it and if you don't want to spend the money on a more expensive under eye treatment that is perfect um they have other options on amazon of course but the pixie one is 24 dollars, and that was only 11 or 12 dollars. so next thing on this list is a 16 piece brush set this is also from amazon but it's broken because it mysteriously fell and one of the ears broken but it's a cat you guys know that i love cats and these are the brushes I'm so happy that I kept this. Um, this is like the little booklet that came with it. It has 16 makeup brushes, four makeup sponges, and one brush washing egg. So, so the egg, like you put your, you take the brush cleaner that you're gonna use, you wet it, and then you scrub it on the egg. It's so perfect, and it comes with so many beauty blenders. I haven't even used all of them yet, but and I've had it for like a year now, so yeah and all of the brushes are really 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 good quality um i was kind of nervous at first because it was maybe like 12 dollars, 13 dollars for 16 brushes um so i didn't really know what that was gonna be like it was my first time getting brushes from amazon but i absolutely love these brushes and i love that it came with so many because brush sets that i've gotten in the past they've had maybe like 10 brushes in them and not even a full set of brushes not like a lot of eye makeup brushes so i was like continuously cleaning them or trying to like do something else like find other brushes but this set is perfect it comes with brushes for foundation powder your eyebrows eyeshadow eyeliner all of that like in one complete set and it's not breaking bank like you know a good set for morphe is like $50, $60, $70, like, you know, and it might not even have all of those sets. And it definitely doesn't come with beauty blenders and it definitely doesn't come with something to clean your brushes. So that's something that I love about that set. And I, so this next item, um, as I was recording this video, like getting ready. So this next item, as I was getting ready to record this video, I was like thinking about where are my beauty blenders that I just mentioned that I got from that brush set and I have them all put away which is kind of problematic because I always find myself doing my makeup and then I'm like I don't have a brush then I have to so as I'm recording my videos I always find myself thinking I don't have a beauty blender where are they I have to go look for one I have to go clean it and then yeah it just adds time to the process like all my beauty blenders are like tucked away somewhere and problematic obviously so I was like thinking beauty blender holder and I had seen a couple of them before but when I was like getting my like myself together to make this video I was like that would be the perfect beauty must have that everyone needs it just makes sense I have my vanity right in front of me I have all of my makeup that I use like most frequently in front of me I always need a beauty blender every time I use my makeup and I don't have anywhere to put them so I ordered that it's in the mail because of the snowstorm it's a little bit delayed but it should be here tomorrow I think and it's so cute and it'll just go right here on my vanity like I'm so excited for it so I can put my beauty blenders in there and I'll always have them nice and handy and I'm so excited to get it it's gonna be so cute like the way that my vanity is set up is so cute I'll show you guys one day maybe I'll show you guys today
I don't know, Monday. The next thing on this list is my reusable eco-friendly cotton rounds. I showed them in my skincare routine, so check that out. Um, it comes with six bamboo cotton pads for makeup removal, five bamboo cotton pads for toner, and five velvet bamboo cotton pads for sensitive areas. So anything that's a little bit hard to reach, and those are smaller, and then the like they come in three different sizes but i was like getting really into reusable items at one point that were eco-friendly so i looked into that and i found that and i was so excited so it's just like washcloth material and it makes it so much easier to remove your makeup um the other um like as someone that wears makeup using that is actually very helpful because you don't have to keep spending money on buying new ones so I like that and it's also good for the environment and I love that they come in three different sizes which is perfect because some days you might have on more makeup, some days you might have on less and some days like you just might not need a lot, you know what I mean? So yeah, that's perfect and it also came in this little nap bag so that it'll make washing and storing them easier. I have them put away right now but um, yeah, it was super cute and yeah, I just love that. So to use them, all you do is take whatever makeup remover, makeup balm that you use and you put it on the cloth or you just rub it across your face. I mean, it depends. Everyone does it a little bit differently, but yeah, you just do that and then you just wipe it away and then clean your face and then go about your business. So the next thing that I use is charcoal, activated charcoal for whitening your teeth. Um, I drink absolutely way too much coffee like I used to have white teeth until I developed this coffee addiction so yeah I have to do that consistently and sometimes I get a little bit lazy with it but it's so easy to use all you do is wet your toothbrush you get some powder put it on your toothbrush and you use it I showed it in a video um before but I got copyrighted so I took down but I'll show you guys a clip of that and how I do it it's so easy and it works like instantly and when you're super consistent with it your teeth look immaculate like I really love it and I love having white teeth I love having a pretty smile I think that's important for everyone I think everyone loves a nice smile so definitely check that out and it was not expensive I mean I've had it for a minute now first of all I've had it for a little over a year now and I still have not run out like it comes with a lot and obviously you don't use like od toothbrush when you brush your teeth like you're not supposed to i know some people do although they're not supposed to but yeah so it lasts a long time next thing is something that i got for christmas i got a wax kit as you guys know like i've mentioned before as you guys know getting a professional wax can be a little bit pricey if you know maybe you're not working or you just think it's expensive in general but i got this wax kit i believe it was about 15 dollars, and it came with um the wax beads it came with um it came with those sticks there were two different sizes there was a bigger one and then there was a smaller one and they had the little spatula thingies that you put wax on and you put it came with the little nose wax strips that you like put the wax on and you put it in your nose and you rip your nose hairs out um yeah and it's so easy to use so you just put the beads in it and then you let the wax sit and melt and then you just rip the hair off um i think i might do a little tutorial on how i use my wax kit if you guys are interested let me know down below in the comments and i would definitely do that for you guys because i have used it about three times since I got it and I love it and it's so easy and I'm it's getting I'm getting much better at doing it to make it even easier but it's already easy to use and it's super small so it doesn't take up a lot of space and I just put it away like nice and neat and perfect so it's like it's a good investment and it's also not very expensive anyway so if you want to save a little coin get your own wax kit watch a little tutorial and then wax yourself like amazing next thing is tens skin oil um so i see a lot of people talk about it on tiktok it is for ingrown hair and in, and razor bumps um my aunt that also has a youtube channel she mentioned it in one of her videos and she was like telling me about it before so i definitely had to check it out and i tell you i love it 
so much so after you shave or if you notice you have ingrown hairs just exfoliate the area wash it dry or whatever and then you put a little bit of the oil a little bit goes a long way on that area and it reduces redness it reduces the um unpleasant looking ingrown hairs and it makes the area look so much better and i also suffer from strawberry skin i have it on my legs and I have it on my arms, my legs so much, mm, like that's that's manageable at this point. But yeah, on my arms, I don't even shave, like I don't shave my arms or remove any hair on my arms. But when I exfoliate them and I don't even like remove any hair, I just put a little bit on the back of my arms. That's where I have the strawberry skin at. And it looks so much better after doing that. Like I haven't even remove any hair you don't necessarily need to remove hair to use is basically what i'm trying to say so yeah check that out it is definitely a lifesaver especially if you're someone that's super into hair removal check that out but that's all for today's video like i mentioned all the items will be linked below i will also be sharing a spreadsheet that has all of the links to all of the amazon items that i use and love um, if you guys want to see more Amazon videos, let me know down below. Don't forget to comment how many times you get a package from Amazon because I know that you get a lot because I get a lot. I think we're all at this point a little bit addicted to Amazon in an unhealthy way. So yeah, let me know down below. And let me know if you've tried any of these products as well. I will be keeping these videos coming. As you guys can tell, I've been super consistent lately. Um, and yeah, that's all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And I'll see you in my next video.